welcome to another Musical Theatre Factory vlog. I'm Diana Huey and I'm playing Ariel in the fifth production of Disney's The Little Mermaid. And I'm Matthew Kasurgis and I'm playing Prince Eric. We're here to talk to you today about our magical production of Disney's The Little Mermaid. I'm playing Ariel and she is a young mermaid who doesn't feel like she really fits in with all of the other merfolk and her sisters or her dad and she really wants to discover what her sense of home is. Prince Eric is a uh, young heir to the throne who's feeling the pressure to take up his father's crown, but he lost his family really young and he hasn't really felt like he's explored enough of the world or gotten to know himself well enough to really take on that responsibility. And so this kind of follows him on his journey to discover what he really wants out of life. I first started working at the Fifth Avenue Theater as an acting intern in Maine while I was still in college, and then went on to do the Adventure Musical Theater educational tours, and then I was in the production of Rent a few years ago, and last season was in Jasper and Deadland. This is my Fifth Avenue main stage debut. Um, I've been really lucky to perform in some spotlight nights and a lot of readings and workshops, which is one of my favorite things about the Fifth Avenue, but I'm really excited to make my main stage debut. The Little Mermaid was my favorite Disney movie as a kid. I grew up watching the movie over and over again and seeing every song and pretending to be her. So it's so exciting to get to actually <laughs> pretend to be her, for real. <laughs> I also grew up with uh, the Disney movies, particularly Alan Menken's scores, and it kind of taught me how songs can contribute to storytelling and is definitely responsible for the reason that I love musical theater so much. But I've also always loved to do impressions, so it's I, I loved the, how big and loud and just kind of fantastical the characters are, and, and I definitely probably knew every single word to this movie when I was a kid. So what's gonna be really magical about this production of The Little Mermaid is to make it look like we're swimming, we will be flying. So we're wearing these harnesses, we will be on wires, and we will be swimming through the air, and it's gonna make the whole stage look like the deep, deep, deep ocean. So uh, Prince Eric has a lot more stage time than he does screen time in the original film. Um, and of course, the way that we uh, go about informing kind of those decisions and that storytelling is it's all on the page. And the writers of the show have written some really beautiful new material. I get to sing some really cool songs. And they've really, um, I think, tried to focus on what connects the two of them so they can really build that relationship and kind of see how that develops and how they're there for each other. I'm really excited to finally get to play a Disney princess, much less Ariel, um, which has always been a dream. But what's so exciting for me is getting to do it for families and for all the kids out there and showing them that anyone can be a Disney princess and you can be anything you want to be in dreams come true. Yeah, in addition to um, being able to sing Alan Menken's incredible music, I have to agree with Diana. I, I got to work at Disneyland uh, a couple years ago, and we would perform for thousands of kids a day. And we, you could see, looking at the audience, you could watch these kids falling in love with these characters, falling in love with musical theater for the first time, and that's just really, really inspiring and really gets you out of bed every day. That's a little preview of the underwater world of Disney's The Little Mermaid. Thanks for joining us, and we'll see you this holiday season at the, the Fifth, Fifth Avenue, Avenue Theater. Theater.